In 2019, my friend Alessandra and I went to Verona. We took a train in Milan and about one hour later, we arrived there. We stayed at a nice hostel 10 minutes from the train station. We visited Casa de Giulietta. It is a touristic place where you can find the statue of Juliet, based on the character in William Shakespeare's place, The Divine Comet, and some other Italian versions from the 14th century. In the entrance of the small castle, there is an alley where the tourists leave love letters and letters to Juliet. Those letters inspired a movie in 2010. In different parts of the city, there are also the tombs of Romeo and Juliet, although they are believed to have been fictional characters. The rises is the moon, and Juliet is the sun. Juliet, Juliet, Alessandra, Alessandra. We went sightseeing in the main square where there is an arena in which the, in the past there used to be gladiators fighting, but now there are concerts and theater plays. There are cathedrals and many statues, and each one of them have their own history. We also saw squares, fountains, castles, and ruins. That night we had dinner at a restaurant, we ate pasta, and had as dessert tortino foldente al cioccolato con gelato alla vanilla, a small hot chocolate cake that has crunchy rind but a soft and creamy filling with vanilla ice cream, or lava cake, how it would be called in USA. We found it strange that it was described as il tortino di cioccolato con cuore morbido, but morbido in Italian means soft. In the following morning, we climbed to the highest part of the city, where there is a park called Campo Gioqui. There, you can see the whole city. In the afternoon, we walked along the river and then parted ways. Alessandra went to Venice and I went to Perugia.